Yo guys, Speedy e back here with an exciting new Pocket Planes video. I was actually out to dinner last night when I saw a tweet by Nimblebit, just simply stating it's done. So after I got home, I fired up my iPad and lo and behold, Pocket Planes update available 2.11. Finally, after 5 years of patiently waiting, we got an update for Pocket Planes. So in this video, I'm going to give my initial reaction on what I think about the new iOS update for Pocket Planes. So on iPad, the first thing you notice is that it takes up the full screen now. No more gray bars around the edges of the screen. And just like the Android version, there's an extra zoom level. Another cool visual change is you can actually see the passengers and the cargo when you look at your list of planes. Another huge quality of life improvement is how smooth it feels when you're scrolling through jobs. Previously, jobs might disappear if you were scrolling too quickly, but it really seems like they've made some good optimizations to the game. The free gift is also new to iOS. If you ever see the gold special plane part as a reward, make sure to do it. I've already received Starship, Concorde, and C-130 parts. The global event system has also changed in iOS. I made a whole video previously about the differences between the two versions. Personally, I'm going to try to grind out these 500 jobs so I can get that Concorde part. There are still a few bugs that Nimblebit has to iron out in this new update. The most exciting feature in the update is the VIP, but currently can't be purchased on iOS. You just get a purchase failed whenever you try to click on it. Nimblebit has acknowledged on Twitter that they're working on it. Another fun bug that I found is being able to lay over more passenger and cargo than what the city allows. You can see here that I should only be able to lay over 60 cargo and passengers, but I'm at 67. I wasn't able to reproduce this bug in other cities, so I think it only happens with cargo and passengers that were sitting in your planes before you updated the game. Overall, I've been really enjoying this update. It's really been a long time coming for those of us who have played pocket planes since the beginning. If you want to see extended gameplay of the update, I did do a live stream this morning that I'll leave a link to. Also, if you haven't subscribed, make sure to do so as I'm going to be making a lot more videos, especially about the VIP feature when it releases. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one.